Hi, I'm Dana Watson. I'm one of the massage therapists with Samaritan Healthcare and Hospice. And I wanted to show you a couple of easy ways to do some self-massage at home for any um, tension or sore muscles um, using some items that you might find around your house. Sometimes when we take out the equation of direct touch, we can really elicit some sensory response in the brain by taking out the portion of the brain doing the work with the hand and putting something between to feel the touch. So really simple. You may have one of these in your shower. Back brush. In this case, we're going to use it dry on the skin. And again, it's just a way to sort of bring an aspect of touch to the skin without directly doing it with your hand and being able to feel those sensations. If you don't have something like this, you can easily make one. This is simply a wooden spoon, rubber band, and you can use a loofah or a washcloth and you can get the same effect. Again, it's just a medium for use just to provide some gentle touch to the skin. If you've got some sore muscles going on in the back, that's a hard place to reach by yourself. So two tennis balls and a sock can be one of your best friends. Simply put them inside that lonely sock that its partner never came out of the dryer. If you tie a knot at the top and leave a little space, you can move the balls around so that you can get, you know, a wider or a closer portion and then you can put them right behind you, lean up against the wall and put a little pressure. Be careful not to induce any pain. Massage should never be painful. There might be a moment of discomfort, but again, massage should never cause you pain. And then maybe you've been doing a lot of walking lately and your quads or your hamstrings or your calves are really tight and sore. You can take a good old rolling pin and use it on those muscles. So you can literally roll out the tension in the thigh. You can do so underneath and you can also get to the calf here simply by rolling the pin. And usually there's enough pressure from the weight to really give you a nice good massage. And then lastly, if your feet are a little bit sore and you're looking for some way to relieve that pain, you can get a water bottle, let a little bit of the water out, put it in the freezer, makes a really good modality for the feet. Or in this case, um, I have a um, hard container that I can use as well. So I simply just put it on the floor in a sitting position so you don't hurt yourself if you're standing and cause any accidents by standing on what you're rolling on but you can put a lot of pressure and roll out any tension on the bottom of the feet. So I hope this has been helpful for you. I hope that you are able to provide yourself with a little pain relief, a little comfort with some items at home and that you get those feel good hormones releasing in the brain as well.